G'day guys, g'day. How you going? Right. This is an SW Motec center stand installed on the 2017 V-Strong. Now, I've got all the parts laid out here, I'll just show you. So they're all laid out there with the tools I think I need, thread locker, all the bits here, center stand of course, and we are going to go and install that on the mighty V-Strom, right there. So I've got a camera set up down there, we'll meet you down at the bike and we'll see how we go. Okay, here we are, we're down at the bike. This is the first bracket that goes on, that one right there. It goes in down here, on here, and we've got all the stuff I think we need right here. So, we will get down there into it. Now, we've got to put the bottom bolt in first, which is that one, and we've got to put a bit of thread locker on it. We'll get on it there. I'll pop that through there. We've got to put a spacer on this one, which is that one right there. And we'll see how we go, eh? Right here, that one started up okay. And we'll just tighten him up. Won't tighten him up all the way. Alright, so that's just finger tight there. Now this spacer here, it's got to go in the back there. Should be able to squeeze him. I'll just take that off just a touch. Should be able to squeeze him in there. Well, we'll soon see, won't we? Be okay if we had a few more fingers. Okay, so the next bit is that little arm. It's got a rubber stop on it for when the stand comes up. Okay, so the first bolt to go in is number 10, which is that one, and that goes in there like that. That is the hole there over the back there. And they're square, I'll be right, and there we go. That in. That up just so. Oh, whoops. Big head rust. That up above that bolt, sorry. Some dickhead tightened it up too far. There we go. Look at that. It's just finger tight there at the moment. So the next little bolt that goes in is this one here. And it's got a little spacer over the back. So that might just be a little harder to do. Because I've got to put that spacer in too, don't I? Anyway, we'll see what goes, eh? Might be able to get the spacer just to hold in there. Maybe. Let's see if we can move that spacer there up just a little bit. Ah. Looks like that spacer's not quite lined up properly. Next step is this top arm here on. And that there has a little spacer behind it too. I was going on these fucking spaces, they could have made that a bit easier for me. Anyway, so I'll just put a bit of Loctite on there. Let's see how we go getting this spacer in there. Hmm. Look at that, that one went straight in. I will try and tighten him up again. Lefty Lucy. Rightio. So, I'll just tighten that down a bit. I won't do it up all the way yet. Is the left hand side bracket install. And I'm hoping I've got no spare parts. Which I don't think I have. Anyway, I might just tighten them down then.
So that's installed on this left hand side. We'll catch, we'll catch you around the right hand side. Okay, we're around the other side. We're all set up around here. We've got our, we've got our centre stand here. We've actually got to put a bit of grease around these shafts here. So I've got a little bit of black molly grease here. I think I'll just put on it. Block, <coughs> black molly grease doesn't wash out as much as other grease. We'll just put the stand on there now. This side here could be a little bit more awkward. I'll go down there. Put that on there. And... Right, so that's the way it sits. That's the way it sits right there. The first bolt we're going to put in is the bottom bolt. It has a spacer as well, so we're going to put a bit of Loctite on that. Well, that one is screwed straight in. Now, for the top bolt, because the exhaust here is in the way, it's really hard to get to. Now, they supplied this bolt with it, a hex, hex head bolt, but I'm going to swap it out for this bolt. Just went and got one yesterday. So then, I can get that onto it, because you can't get that in there square onto it. Anyway, we'll see how we go. Could be a bit of a bugger trying to get this one started. And getting the spacer in there, I guess. Not just tighten that up. Right, so that's just a little... Bit tighter and we'll see how we go getting that spacer in there. This is gonna be fun. Where's Kim when you need her? With a set of little, little hands. If we can start that bolt up and get the shifter on him and see how we go. That's so what I think we're away. No spare parts here. One of the fucking Loctite hasn't gone off by the time I get this bolt in. That's finger tight there at the moment. We'll just tighten this one up. Right. I'll just check this top one again. All's good. So that swings fairly freely. So all we've got to do is, is get this spring on, which they reckon is a real prick. I'll just go and get it. This is the spring, and they reckon that's a bit of a prick to get on. They reckon use a screwdriver or something that's square. I've got a chisel there, so I'm going to try that, and we'll see how we go. So that latches on up there somewhere. Now these two springs have got to stay together, so they tell me. Here we go, that's on there. We've got to stretch that, that there, down to there. So isn't that going to be fun? Pull that stand up and make it a little bit easier. There we go. Might just put a bit of tape around that. Yeah, we go again. Top one's on. Yep. And there we go. Look at that. One little, little scratches here. Just make sure that's seated properly. I really don't want it coming off down the road. Looks like it is. The only thing to do now. <laughs> so if the center stand works, I'll cut back to you in a minute. I'll just show you. So that's it there. That's the center stand there, the spring. 
this is around the right hand side. I'll take it around the left. Left hand side set up here. Right here. There's a kickstand bit there. Right there. So, we'll cut back and see if it works. And there we go. One bike up on the centre stand. So, I'll just take you down there and have a look. That's the mighty V-Strom there. And that's her up on its centre stand. And now it will make it easier for me to do that chain, won't it? That's it there. That's a stopper there. There we go. That is her up on the centre stand. And that is with an SW Motec centre stand for the 650 V-Strom 2017. We'll catch you later guys.